So I finally figured out the new drop times for Rodi for Home Depot and it's actually pretty simple. They're actually just 10 minutes later than what they were previously. So drop time at 535, but it's not 545. 650 is now seven o'clock, so it's just 10 minutes later than what the previous ones were before. And it seems like Rodi is like shadow banning me because I put in for some orders this morning. I'm at the store at a Home Depot right now in Union for the one that was here I got nothing I couldn't even get a CVS order so I might be shadow banned from using roadie and I've seen uh, some people on the roadie Facebook group say that if you don't use roadie for a while which I haven't they won't allow you to get any orders so hopefully that's not the case today hopefully I'm able to get something because you know I don't have anything scheduled today other than a catering order at 1102 I have all my apps on because right now it is crunch time. You know, it's October 24th. We are coming, we are a month away from Thanksgiving and Black Friday, two months away from Christmas. So y'all know it's time to get to work right now. And yet another roadie gig rejected. So it's not looking like we're gonna be making a lot of money today, but I do wanna give y'all five gig apps that you guys need to do because right now we are getting into crunch time for the end of the year. So we need to be as busy as possible so we can make as much money as possible. We don't have time to be sitting around doing nothing. So I'm gonna give you a five apps. Even though I may not like the apps or you may not like the apps, still try to do them. And app number one is obviously Rody. Now a lot of you guys don't like Rody at all for obvious reasons, but believe it or not, I've actually made the most money on Rody this year and also last year. And you know, being rejected for orders is very disappointing, obviously. But uh, you know, you can always get more orders. They have orders all throughout the day, small orders, big orders. And if you absolutely need to make a certain amount of money, Brody XD is a great way to, to do that. Even though you may get rejected from Brody XD routes, they still have a lot of routes. And a lot of routes, most people don't even want to pick because they're going into New York City. But if you absolutely need to make some money, Rody is a great app to do that with. App number two is Instacart. Now, if you guys have seen the video where I actually turned on my Instacart and got a pretty good order from Dick's Sporting Goods, I was absolutely not expecting that. So I actually turn on Instacart every single day because sometimes you get an order like that where it's very simple, just I had to go get some exercise equipment they paid me $40 for it. And I didn't tell you guys, but after I delivered the last order I delivered was a match with somebody, he actually put in that he never got the order, but you guys saw me on camera handing him the order, with that little fat naked kid in the front. But um, Instacart reviewed it and they removed that negative point from my account. So it's a good thing I actually keep record of the things that I deliver, which is the reason why I wear a body cam with every delivery that I do, so I have a record of it. And also, people are going to be starting to order massive amounts of groceries from the store so they can cook for the families for Black Friday, Thanksgiving, Black Friday, and whatnot. So probably a lot of potential to make a lot of money with, with the Instacart. Even though I don't like Instacart that much, still find some unicorn orders here and there. Well, app number three is Delivered. Now, for those of y'all keep asking me, how do you spell Delivered? Even when I put it on the title of the video, it's spelling Delivered out. It is spelled exactly this, D-L-I-V-R-D. It is not a typo. That is how you spell the name of the app, Delivered. Now, Delivered is obviously a catering order app for you guys that have watched my video, have, have uh, watched my videos enough. And you guys have seen me make some crazy money with Delivered. 300, 400, 200, 100 dollar orders. Very simple to do. And lately I have been getting a whole lot of requests for Delivered catering orders. I believe yesterday they sent me three catering orders to deliver. I picked one today, but it seems like they're only letting me do one a day unless I get another one from the open board. Actually, yesterday Delivered sent me four catering orders and on Tuesday, they sent me three catering orders. So catering orders are exploding right now. So you guys have to get on the app delivered. Next app is also a catering app, Deliver That. 
I don't do deliver that that often because a lot of orders in my area are going to New York City and I don't like delivering in New York City at all, especially for the price that those orders are going for. Now recently they've gotten rid of their tip pool. So the tip that you see is a tip that you get. But my thing is uh, on the last deliver that order I did after they gotten rid of tip pool, that order payout was only $18. And with the tip pool, the order payout would have been at least 20. So I don't see myself doing a lot of deliver that orders unless I do do the orders and they increase the payout from the orders that they send me because I'm pretty much at the bottom of the list on deliver that because I haven't done it so much. So I'm not really seeing all the orders that they have available. And the last app is Uber Eats. Now this is not for me a main app because I don't make a lot of money on Uber Eats. For me, it's more like an in-between app where I'm waiting for an order on Roadie or an order on Instacart and I just need something to do to make a quick five, six dollars. That's really what I use Uber Eats for. But there should be a big jump in orders now since we're getting into holiday season and usually people are ordering a lot more than they do throughout the year. And more orders mean higher potential to make more money. Now there's also DoorDash and Grubhub, but I don't use Grubhub and I don't necessarily like DoorDash due to the fact that I have to schedule myself. And I do get a lot better orders on Uber Eats than I do on DoorDash and also a lot more frequent orders on Uber Eats than any other food app that I have. And I just put in for yet another home uh, roadie gig, Home Depot, and yet again, denied. So I think I might be banned from roadie for today. I'm not sure, but it's looking like it that way. All right, well, we gotta go head over to our catering order anyway. So I actually don't see the name of the restaurant because for restaurant, it just says Bridgewater, but that's actually the city I'm picking up in. So I'm picking up two items. Order cost $960.50. A base fee $15 and a tip of $35. So I'll be getting paid $50. This order is going three miles. We got about 20 minutes to get to the pickup. Let's go. Okay, we're in here and I think it's day because this is the only place that has catering orders that I get out here. And that's everything? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. All right, got the order. Now this order is not due until 11.30, but I can deliver it at 11.20. However, it only takes me eight minutes to get to the drop off. So we're gonna have to wait a little bit, but let's go. All right, boys and girls, we wait a little bit. I think we got enough time. Plus, I gotta go to the second floor and load all this stuff up anyway. So, let's get to it. Let's get the hand truck out. All right, I think that'll do it. Just pray the stuff doesn't fall over. Second floor, I think it's 205. Ow. Damn, that shocked the shit out of me just now. Oof. Oof, boy. Let me see if there's anything else over here. Oh, 205. Okay, that way. Right there? Yep. Okay. Just pile everything up and then I'll just pull it back. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. No, we changed it last minute. I couldn't get Chipotle in time. But I prefer to get it. <laughs> 
Thank you so much. You're welcome. I got it. Did you need a picture? Yeah, I sent you a picture of it. That's it. All right, so we're just gonna get a quick 50. Let's see if I can make another $50. I'll be happy with uh, $100 today because right now it's 11.34 and it's very dead right now. So we'll see what happens. So Deliver just sent me three orders for tomorrow. Two of them, which I took. The other one I couldn't take because it was too early in the morning. They wanted it to be picked up at two at 8.02 in the morning. And you know, I'm already, I'm still home getting ready to take my son to school. But at least we do have two orders. Hopefully later on in the day, they'll send me some more orders because I don't have any work for tomorrow other than Isu. All right, finally got an order that's worth doing Uber Eats. Picking up Dunkin' Donuts, two miles for $9. Okay, so we actually have to go inside Walmart to go to Dunkin' Donuts. You got a pickup? Yeah, from Jamie. Yeah. Jamila? It's a Uber Eats order? Yeah. Jamila? Jamila? Both of them? Jamila? Yeah. 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 All right, thank you. It really took a while to give me that damn order. But while I was in it, my man Dan with a plan hit me up, asked me if I could deliver some pallets for him, move to a store, to his warehouse. I said, absolutely. He said he got three pallets for me, so that's gonna be like $150 right there. This person needs to wait, I'm trying to back up. So we gonna do that right after we drop off this order. Thank God for that, oh, man. All right, so this person put on the hat to leave that door and also leave that door. But well, we gotta go do more stuff, so we're just gonna leave it at the door. You can get it right here. And yeah, take photo. Oh my god, I never take photo. Come on. There we go. Let me out of here. Okay, it looks like they're ready for me. So we got 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18 boxes. Alright. We're gonna make it work. Okay, let's see what we got. Okay. Alright, so they actually fit better when I stand them up. There we go. One more. That's it. Let's go. Okay, here. And of course, there's a charger in the way. Okay. Hey. Hiding in the back. Oh, yeah. Um, let's see if we can get this guy to know. Yeah, I got 18 in the van and I'm taking two pallets? Yeah. Okay. All right, that's better. They're, they're separated. Thank you. 
Okay, cool. You gonna take some? Yeah, the uh, max. You got some more coming on this one? Huh? You got more coming? No, this is everything. Okay. Yeah. Right. Jesus Christ. Ooh. It's coming. All right, you're clear. That's good. Yes, I did. Okay. Okay. Thank God for Dan because I was not seeing myself making a hundred dollars today. Absolutely wasn't seeing it. So thank God we made two hundred dollars today. Fantastic. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. See y'all next time.